Hey there, and welcome to another video. So March 10th is actually Mario Day, and to celebrate Nintendo's lovable Italian plumber, I made one of his iconic enemy. No, not him. I'm talking about this one. This video was made in collaboration with other crafting channels and a special thanks to Carobix for inviting me and please don't forget to check out the other videos in the playlist. Anyways, let's get started. I'll start by making the green pipe. I made a cylinder out of aluminum foil and covered one end with brown clay and the other end in green clay. And then I'll cover the rest of the cylinder with a thin layer of green clay. I'll add a strip of clay to make the rim on top and softly blend the seam with my tool. I twisted a piece of armature wire into the shape of a question mark and we'll cover it in green clay to create the stem. For the head, I made a ball of red clay, then cut out the clay to make a Pac-Man shape. But that's not really today's theme, so I'll hollow out the inside with a carving tool. Then I'll add the lips, I'll quickly sand the stem to make it super smooth before attaching it to the head. I'll add a tiny ring around the stem and throw everything in the oven before making the teeth. I baked the piranha plant one more time to harden the teeth so I can add the tongue without smushing everything. I made a paper template and will use it as a guide to cut the shape of the leaves. I'll softly pinch the side of the clay to soften the edges. And I'll carve a line in the middle with my tool. Then I'll gently bend the clay backwards to give it a nice curved shape. Since this project was on a tight deadline, I was originally just gonna use colored clay and skip the step of painting. But I was not careful when sculpting and the clay got pretty dirty, so I was gonna have to repaint it anyways, so I might as well sand it to buff out the imperfections. And while I'm painting, Maybe now would be a good time to give this video a like, or maybe even consider subscribing. I'll finish painting these dots and then I'll start working on the base. I made a big lump of aluminum foil and covered it with clay. Then I cut a hole at the top to fit the pipe. 
To add texture, I use a ball of crumpled aluminum foil. I painted the base with acrylic paint. I wanted to make it look like two different sections of soil with a section of moss on the top. And it ended up looking not so great. It isn't bad, but it really wasn't what I was going for. So to fix it, I added a generous coat of Mod Podge and covered the bottom section in sand and the second section in soil. And then I'll seal everything with a generous coat of Mod Podge. Next, I'll add fake moss that I made using a shredded sponge mixed with green acrylic paint. It dried all in one big piece, so it's easy to glue on in big chunks. Now that all the pieces are finished, let's start assembling everything. The last thing to do is to add these mini super mushrooms that I made off camera. And that's it. Let's move on to the glamour shot. Thanks for watching, don't forget to check out the videos in the playlist and I'll see you next time!